Hey everyone, welcome to World Heritage Journey, where today we're at the Cathedral of Notre Dame in Chartres, central France. So today we're in the city of Chartres in central France, about 80 kilometers to the southwest of Paris. And we're looking at the cathedral here dedicated to the Virgin Mary. It was built between the 12th and 13th centuries over a fairly short time period. And it's considered to be the absolute masterpiece of French Gothic architecture. It's noted for its sculpture and its stained glass and it's very beautiful. Let's check it out. The exterior of the cathedral here is fairly typical of French Gothic, but it is absolutely beautiful and is really well preserved as well. It hasn't actually changed all that much since it was finished in the 13th century, aside from a couple of chapels and the taller of the two towers that was added in the 16th century. Now, it's also covered in sculpture, like the ones you can see behind me, and they're in really good condition. They depict typical scenes from the life of Jesus, and particularly the Virgin Mary, who the church is dedicated to. So this is the interior of the cathedral here and it's got that soaring magnificence that you expect from a French Gothic cathedral. But it's a real contrast in here because the centre is very light and bright and almost airy because it's been recently repainted whereas the side aisles and various other bits are very dark and gloomy from centuries of candles and oil lamps. And there's a big debate about the restoration as well. Some people say they're restoring the church to how it was when it was built. Others say the way it has ended up is the way it should remain. The cathedral is famous for its stained glass and in total there's around 12,000 different scenes done in stained glass from the Bible, both the New and Old Testament. And behind me is one of the most famous of the lot. It's known as Notre Dame de la Belle Verrière and it dates from the 12th century. It's actually so old, it's older than the cathedral that it's installed in because it comes from the previous building that was on the site. It's famous because of its beautiful use of blue stained glass. It's got a really pale colour, which is very unusual. These French Gothic cathedrals are all just so beautiful. And I've really enjoyed visiting them all, particularly this one. But that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm Joel on the road and I'll see you at the next World Heritage Site.